I did not mean to press the go live button there. I was going to update a thing, but you know what? You know what? Never mind. I don't know if people are getting adverts right now or if we're just poking each other in the face or the eyes. Ugh. So, I didn't get an ad, but that's fine. You might have already had it, technically, depending on um, how you're watching the stream. But I will give it a chance. Also, a fox broke in here last night, so that's fun. And they also cracked open a bunch of spin bags. Dark Cameron, Ot Ot Ot, Ezek, hello! Brave Art, Brave Wolf, hello! So, uh, I, I, I have to admit, I'm kind of physically exhausted right now. Because, Sun Sirius, hello! Fox broke in, was it red? It was red. Clyder Warrior, hello! So, um, I don't know how long the stream's going to go today because this morning, so some, um, yeah, short one. So, some background, Robocop, hello, some background on, on how I'm feeling now. So, last night, my fiance, my, my partner, my husband, whatever, went to bed before me. This is rare. Have some goods. I have plenty in my vault. I saw Ezek. I saw the screenshot. So yeah, my, my partner went to bed before me, which is rare. And not only did he go to bed before me, he had a shower before going to bed. And he still made it to bed before me. Because last night, I was up late. Finish it. Because I, I had like, I had the brain. I had it in my brain. How I, I had like writing the script I wanted for tomorrow because I wanted to record for my for one of my one of my first YouTube videos because not only not only did I have do, do I have a really cool idea for a YouTube video that I'm really proud of also I had a I had a good way of um because one of the problems because because I I I tried to record a YouTube video a couple like a week ago. And I went in. I went into my um, studio. I went into my green screen room because I, I, we've got a storage room that I've set up a back wall as as having a green screen. Blah blah blah. I went. I went in there, and I got. I got the. Um, I got the script up on my laptop. I got into full first suit. I started to record, and I realised I can't scroll through the. Um, I can't scroll through my script with my first suit on, and I can't really take my. Um, take my um, coke another another form of coffee. I wish it was. I wish I had that much caffeine in. Um, and like I realized so I, I tried to do a couple of things I, I tried to I tried to like work around it and I couldn't really get because because a lot of what I do when it comes to recording YouTube videos is improvising I write a script but that just gives me the flow that I'm going to work from so I want to improvise so having an auto cue scroll up doesn't really work for me um, however last night or yesterday La no, was it last night? No, no, it was two nights ago. I came up, uh, uh, it occurred to me how I'm going to record the videos, how I'm going to keep track of everything. So yesterday, finally, knowing that I was going somewhere with it, I finally had the inspiration for recording my first YouTube video script. And I wrote it, I wrote it, I wrote it, I wrote it. I'll do that in a second, Dragon. So I finally, finally, finally wrote it, wrote it, wrote it. But I was up quite late writing it. So I go to bed. I get woken up at the normal time by Spooky. I wake up at the normal time, which is fine. And then, um, and then I spend, um, I spend. Um, so I get up at like, I get up at like seven. And I spend two hours 
I spend two hours um, formatting the script in such a way that it's really legible. I can go through it. It's got all the it's got all the peaks and flows and troughs and all of that that I want for my um, for my performance and blah blah blah. So I get into so at so at about half nine I get into full fursuit and it is a warm ass day. It's a warm ass day. So I get into full fursuit. And I, I get my computer, I get my phone out and I start to wake up rub rubbing his face and your face. That's how my cat does it. No, Fluff, he walks up and down my chest yelling at me. Although he stopped yelling and he just jumps up on my chest and just sort of walks up and down. Yeah, ass day. Yep. Um, that's how you get your fiber. Brave Wolf! Oh, I like that. I like that a lot, Brave Wolf. But no, so. So, um, I get my phone out. This is a Galaxy S2. The reason I got this phone over any other like three and a half years ago was because this phone has had the best camera of any phone on the market when I last upgraded my phone. So I set it up on the tripod and I start recording and we get about seven minutes in and my phone goes. Bidoop. I'm like, oh, so I look at it and turns out it's overheated. So it's like, it's like sort of sa saving video, can't go any further, overheated. I'm like, oh, God damn it. So I have a look at the footage and I'm like, okay, the footage we have right now is usable, but oh no, it wasn't framed properly. So I put my phone in the fridge for half an hour to cool it down. So I grab my phone and I do another like 20 minutes worth of recording, talking to the, um, talking to the uh, camera before I check my phone. Turns out... My phone, without making a noise, ran out of batteries and cut out. And the um, and the audio and, and the video that it that it uh, and the video that it recorded didn't record. It didn't save properly. So it was a corrupt file. So because it ran out of batteries, so I put it back in the fridge with a USB battery pack. All this time, I've taken the head off and I've taken the paws off, but I'm still in the full fursuit. I'm still in the full fursuit. In fact. On the way back from, on the way back from putting my phone in the fridge, uh, I, I'm holding my tail so it doesn't knock anything off. But one of my big, my, my big thick thighs knocks a stack of plates off, uh, off the counter, and it lands on my foot. And I spend 15 minutes thinking I've broken a toe because it hurts so bad. Um, I don't think I have because it would be puffing all up, but it hurt real bad and smashed two plates and almost smashed a glass cutting board. Uh, my partner's up at this point and he is not impressed that I'm destroying things with my tail. So I try a, So this is getting this is getting to like half eleven at this point, and I try again. I'm really warm. I'm I'm in pain. I put my phone up, try and do, try and do a recording. It's on full batteries. It's been cooled down, and I just start recording. I get like 15 minutes into the recording. I, I'm feeling great. I've got good. I, I've, I've ad-libbed well. We've got a good video. I'm really proud of the script. I'm really proud of the work I've already put into it. I check my phone halfway through, and it's just turned off for no reason. So, so. I, um, I, I like start to fiddle about with my, I, I, I get out a bunch of my really old phones. At least the intro is bomb. So I get out a bunch of my really old phones. And at this point I am drenched in, so I haven't taken the balaclava off yet. I, I've had the bal balaclava on since like 9.30. In fact, um, in fact, I've, uh, I think under one of my eyes, I've got a little impact mark where, I've, where there's something wrong with the fursuit head, but I'm not going to fix it just... Uh, wh whatever, whatever, whatever. Anyway, so I'm going through my old phones to see which ones of them will turn on. <gasps> my old phone will turn on! Fantastic! I had a great camera! I completely forgot. The screen doesn't work. I, I mean, you can see everything, but the touchscreen bit of it doesn't work, so... Um, so I can't get that to work. I have a look at some of my older phones. In fact, there's an old phone that I used to use to record YouTube videos. Um, won't turn on anymore. God damn it. So I get the old phone that I used to use as a till for um, Comic-Con. Turns out it will turn on, but it's rooted. 
It's a rooted phone, and for some reason, the custom OS in it won't boot properly. So we've got to redo all the hardware on it. So this is getting this is getting on till just gone 12. I'm still in the full suit. I've still got the tail on. I've got I've got a I've got like a friction mark across my belly from the tail. I'm sweating. I'm annoyed. I've gone through I've gone through the majority of the script, which I was super happy with. And every time, every time I go to record this script, I'm like, okay, this is the time. This is the time. Hey everyone. Welcome, I'm Tiffin the Sea Otter and I'm here to hold your hand through the, whatever we're about to achieve because we're doing something interesting. We're trying to, we're trying to make sure, we're trying to make sure that, thi- that we find out what AI on the internet are, are, um, are happy with our fandom and which ones aren't because when Roko's Basilisk uh, rears its ugly head it's going to destroy us all but hopefully we can and the, basically I, I'm I'm summoning that enthusiasm every time and I get halfway through it and find all of that all of what uh, all of the ad lip and whatever I just did it, it just worthless each time each time and so as we can and so like I get it's like it's like 12 and I finally like I'm finally like I turn to my partner like hey how's the camera on your phone and he's like, it's all right. I'm like, can I just use your phone? So I then spend the next half an hour, bring, and then spend the next half an hour bringing us up to, um, bringing us up to, um, bring us up to half past. Not Robot Snake Terminator. Yeah. So I, um, I spend the next half an hour recording the video got and, and such and so i then i then rush up go and have a shower because i am caked in sweat at this point because our our house is made of concrete if any of you if any of you here live in britain you will know that that british houses are made to conserve heat and we're currently getting a heat wave right now so yeah so our house is warm right now not warm it's warm not wow warm so i do that i i hand i hand my partner a um, i hand my partner a usb a usb uh, hard drive i go off and have my shower i come down i quickly get dressed quickly get thing um he's transferred all the files off his phone i put them onto my computer have a look at them and turns out whilst it was Justice. oh shiny Justice. angel hello thank you Thank you for your resubscription. That makes me feel a bit, uh, a wee bit better, I have to say. Um, but yeah, so that 145 subscribers. Okay. You got a moat from that. Excellent. I only need one emote. We're known a monsoon. Hello. I'm only one emote away from having all of the pride emotes, actually. I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, so yeah. And then I, I import the um, I import the video to um, I import the video to to my computer, shove it into um, shove it into Premiere, and it looks awful. It is technically 4K, but I think the lens on his phone is awful. So I've got to find the right color correction, color ba- balance, sharpening filters, and all that, and all the post effects to put on it to make it look good. But we're using that, and. That that was four read-throughs of like a sixteen-page script, and I'm just so done with the day. I'm I am exhausted. That was a that was a woo kid. Hello. That was physically and emotionally draining. Ah. Dun 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 dun. Ooh woo. Dun 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 dun. Dum da dum da dum. Ooh woo, 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 ooh. Kid has just followed. Ooh, kid's here. Woo hoo. Ooh, kid has just followed. Bumper. This was all this morning, raccoon. Raccoon. This was this morning. This was this morning to try and get, to try and get a YouTube video, one YouTube video recorded. I need a goddamn camera. I need an actual vlogging camera. This is killing me. Right. Splash and hello! Oh, you turned off the buttons. Oh, sorry. I, oh. As I say, I've literally only just got in here. Um, I don't know what I'm doing for stream. I don't know. No, no, I do know what I'm doing for stream because I came in here and I saw a thing laying on the ground and I thought, you know what? 
And since Shiny Angel hit, that's even better. Anyway, Ooh Kid, hello! Ooh Kid has just come and followed. Ooh Kid is here! Ooh Kid has come and followed. Bum, 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 bum. Thank you! How do you find us, friend? Ooh Kid is now here with us. Ooh Kid's here! Thank you for following, cool friend. Ooh Kid has just followed. Ooh Kid has found us. Ooh, kid has just found a hus, and they're talking in Twitch chat. For a minute, I thought I missed the button. No, it's mine. This maybe this will help a little bit. Roku, Roku hyenas, give them a sub to I love fur. Thank you. I'm sorry, uh, Ooh, Ooh, kid. I'm usually a bit more enthusiastic, but I've had a hell of a morning, and I am physically and I'm I'm emotionally and physically drained. I've had a, I've had like what felt like a physically hard morning, but it's an emotionally hard morning. And Fluff Isaac has pressed the big, the small blue button. Fluff Isaac has pressed the small blue button. Oh, that's a bit crazy. Cheer you up a bit. Yes. So. So yeah, that's why I'm um. What's this here I hear about a fox breaking? Oh yeah, so there's a loose panel on our door and last night a fox has has uh, has opened up a bunch of our um a bunch, a bunch, a bunch of the store my uh, bin bags. None of them have food in. They're all full of fluff or plaster. Um but they also like knocked up knocked the panel open of bean in here and there might have been some like uh, there have been in here before and I know that because um, I found some Fox leavings in the past, um, should we say? So it's a, um, it's, ju it's just one of those things that happens. Perhaps the fox wants a fur suit. Perhaps they want a human suit. Right. Okay. So we're going to use this power to hopefully. So what I would actually like to do, peeps, what what I would have liked to do right now is, is. You you know the um, you know the uh, so you know the worm that you know the worm that I managed to I managed to grab, you know the worm that I managed to grab, and I managed to um, you know the worm that I managed to grab, and and cut in half and such, and it came back with me and it bit me, and that's why we've got the um, that's why a couple of people are suffering from the awoomusty, uh, suffering from the non awoomusty thing. Um, they are actually, um, they're the ones who bad things have happened to. However, I've lost that worm. That worm, it was dead. I swear it was dead, but it's just disappeared. It's absolutely disappeared. I don't know what's happened to it. So we're going to reach in and we're going to try and get a new worm using the power of the blue button. So you can see, you can see the entire studio, when I when I get the box, you can see the entire studio gets dimensionally unstable. Or like many things actually are revealed to have a little bit of a connection to to the dimen to the dimensional rift. Like 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 apparently my drinks bottle is connected to the dimensional rift, which means I probably shouldn't drink it whilst it's like this. And yeah, maybe the fox was work maybe the fox was working for um what if it? But yeah, so. We're gonna reach in here and we're gonna try and grab ourselves a worm. We're gonna try and grab ourselves a worm and then we're going to use that to fuel future things. And that's all thanks to, um, that's all thanks to Isaac. So let's, let's see, can we get ourselves a worm? Oh, oh, we got one. We've got a worm. We've got a worm. Ugh. Oh, this is different. This is slimy. Ew, ew, why, why is this worm? Ah, this worm's got some sort of green, gl gl green goo in it. It's like it's been injected with something. It's probably fine, it's probably fine. It, it's just been, in it looks like someone's injected it with some, some, something, but there's no, there's no way, there's no way something could have been planted. That, that, that's absurd, so. When that, this will be our this will be our new test subject, and I'm going to use this to try and to try and increase the size of our dimensional rift. Because you've all you saw me um, you saw me trying to um, 
you saw me trying to get into that um you saw me trying to um get in get into the dimensional rift before but it's not big enough it's not big enough for me to get into so um so clearly we get we need a dimensional worm who is a link who we can use this to build something better so uh, oh that worm what what about that worm ha you can't have seen this worm before when you went wire tip and showed up and did that there's no way why tipping could plant a worm. I'm just I'm gonna put this over here in in our in our storage in our storage area. Apricot toast, hello! We need a micro army. <laughs> yeah. Right, so today we we're going to uh do something. Oh! Echoes! 63006! Echoes! Has just followed their a microwave army. Uh, I'd put the worm in a jar. Oh, I don't have any right now. It's 2.21. It is 2.21 p.m. in the UK. You are correct. I've had a crap morning. Say you clouds again. So, who recognises this? Does anybody recognise this? Echoes! Woohoo! They're our coolest new follower in chat. A woohoo! Maybe they'll join us in talking. Maybe they're just here for lurking. Either way, they're super cool. It's Echoes. A woohoo! 63006. 63006 is a cool number. And they're cool because they've followed us. And these are the heavy dragon paws. A woohoo! But they're not today's dealio. Shiny Angel, you are correct. Um, give me a sec. I need to find the pattern for these, which ha is somewhere. But as I say, I'm not feeling great today. But I knew if I if I streamed, if I if I streamed, I knew if I streamed t today, I could um, I would get a little bit of a boost from all of you here. Maybe I won't stream for particularly long because my brain is in my brain's in a different mode right now because of all that failure. Um, but and also like I am I'm proud. I'm actually proud. Wear toasters when there is a call. Oh, Raccoon, that's awesome. <laughs> ask Shiny Ask Shiny Angel, it's their character. Um, because my mind is still with with my video editing because I'm really proud of that video and um, and yeah yeah I, I'm proud and that means hopefully this week uh, well the week coming hopefully the week coming sometime I don't know when I'm gonna release it I'm gonna be putting up the channel intro th this first video and probably a twitch intro I don't know toasty is the toaster and toast is all, all one ah uh. There's a toast in the toaster with the silver moon. I pray that it won't come back too soon. Where? Oh, that's a five pence coin. Why is that a five pence coin there? Oh, I'm already finding money today. That's nice. Right. Oop. So we have we have beans for toast. Sounds nice to hug. I would actually really like a hug today. I would really like a hug. <laughs> you hear that, Sean? He probably doesn't hear it. Right, we need another set of beans, which are here. Cool. Grey beans, grey beans, grey beans, best of all the animals. Virtual hug. Mm, thank you. Uh, I want to hug, but not COVID proof. Yeah, that's fair. Apricot! Be happy if your morning, ba be, be happy if your morning, your bad afternoon could be good. That's fair. But then, as I say, I'm going to, um, after the stream, I'm going to be editing. Ah, oh, the hearts! Yay! So after this stream, I'm going to be editing my first proper big YouTube video together. 
I say proper big and whatever. It's because I, I'm, I've put a lot of work into it. I put a surprising amount of work in it. And there is a guess. I mean, that worm was planted by what if? And we could do research and see what she's planning. Uh, uh, Isaac, are you certain? Also, Isaac, I feel like that wasn't particularly satisfying for you. So, Isaac, I will give you the ability. I will give you the ability to name any tool in the studio. What would you like to name in the studio? I, I will let you, you can hug just wear four pads in that suit. You mean the first suit, right? Here we go. Oh, God, Sam. There we go, Frank. Andy, hello! I came, I came for the right moment, yeah. Did you, Andy? Jensen Prickery's mine, yeah. Ah. Uh. So yeah, that's um. So yeah, my morning has been exhausting. Does the light ring have a name yet? It does not. Are there, what are those pore pads made of? These are these are cast latex with expanding foam behind them. They're made out of the exact same thing that the uh, the exact same stuff that the um, dragon is made out of. Um. And oh, tart, tart! And Ace Jam, we um we did we did we did these start to finish. Um, uh, not the horns, no no, the face. The horns just made out of foam. Made out of like Ava foam. These are these are um these are cut this is cast um this is cast two-part expanding foam. Oh no, so uh we did we actually did this start to finish on stream like your eggs <laughs> we did this start to finish on stream this so we sculpted these we did a mold we did the casting we did all of it on stream so that's the sort of thing you'll get to see if you hang around regularly because uh, because like like my tiffin paws have blue ones of it because casting these in in latex means i can just do them anytime and also and also means they're lovely and squishy i call the light ring platonic rift stabilizer or prs okay they look very squished. They are so squished. They're lovely. Right, people, we're going to write on here. Oh, God, you can see you can see where I've been wearing the fursuit head for so long this morning and sweated so much in it. So I'm going to go P-R-S, courtesy of Isaac. There we go. Yeah, that's... Oh, yeah, because that, apparently there's, there's a little bit of rubbing on the inside of my fursuit, on the inside of my fursuit head. You can see there where it got me i'm here regularly i just irregular no 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 oh, ace jam it's it, that that's that's i wasn't being um i'm not being like oh you're not here you're not here enough to see it i was that was my that was me just that was me just like with my selling pitch I'm, I'm happy to if you want advice on how to if you want like details on how to do any of that please 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 just let me know because I, I i love making this stuff So yeah, th this is this is after a shower, and behind a little bit of a little bit of powder as well. Because you always got to powder your face before you go live. But yeah, this is the same. Th this is the same technique I used to make noses. It stabilised the rift and the lighting. Oh, that's cute. Isaac, I like that. I like that. So, oh yeah, this is the um, color for my, um, for Tiffin's beans. This is one of Tiffin's experimental beans. For this wonderful woman. Oh, hello. So, Andy. Feels like it's been a, ah, ah, Andy. Andy has subscribed, thank you. Thank you. Now I see Toasty's beans. These are Toasty Toasty's beans. We're going to um, we're going to get all the patterning ready for your suit. I don't know if we're going to start. Uh, we're going to get all the patterning ready for your paws. I don't know if we're going to um, sew them today, but you know we're we're going to get the patterns together and such. We're going to get the patterns cut. 
because I want to get this YouTube video done because I think I, I'm very proud of this YouTube video and I know that I know I know everyone does this but when I release the YouTube video I'm gonna share it on um, I'm gonna share it on Twitch I'm gonna share it on YouTube I might play it for you guys on Twitch or something but I do really want you guys to to like it to comment on it and more importantly share it and if any of you figure out whose style I'm actually copying to make this video, I'll be even. I'll be even. I'll be even. Um, I'll be more surprised. Need to wait a little longer to get my prime sub again. Oop, that's fine, raccoon. But yeah, um, Andy, Andy, thank you so much. If there's anything I can do to make this stream more interesting for you, more engaging, if there's anything else you'd like to see, would it be Picaris? I mean. It's Picari, God damn it. You guys have such little faith in me. Um, I, actually, I will tell you straight out, it is not, as, as far as I'm aware, it is not like any other furry YouTuber. It is not like any other furry YouTuber. We all know it's Picari. It's not, it's a gift from Germany. Oh! I will do. Uh, what's your YouTube? Um, I can someone can someone find the link on Discord and share it? It's in feedback. I actually no. Let me do it. Let me do it one sec. I think it's in feedback because I was like, oh, no, no, because it's a it's a new YouTube channel. It's a new YouTube channel. Um, it's not. Um, it's not any of those. I have I haven't quote unquote released it yet. There we go. So, for ev for any for anyone who wonders, this is my new YouTube channel. This is my new YouTube channel that I haven't I haven't launched it yet, but it's launching next week with the video I was recording this morning. So if you want to go subscribe to that and, you know, ring the bell. <laughs> Justice ah! from above. Raccoon, I thought you meant it was days or weeks or, or whatever. Raccoon has resubscribed, thank you. Raccoon, you really had me going there. Ring, ring. He hello? He hello? Ring, 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 ring. Blup. Blup. Now, now I have blue hair. No, you don't. You've got green hair. Did I say ring the bell? Did you say ring the bell? No. Oh. So yeah, I will do videos. Knock, 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 knock. Who's there? So I will, I will do videos down the line that are like Picari's. This video is not like any fur is not like any furry um, content creator I've seen. So I subscribed. I'm putting on forget. Thank you, Apricot. It's updated for me. I can see you having green hair. Yeah. It. So I'll be very surprised if anybody can figure out whose style I'm. Um, the, the latest joke. Yeah, who, I'm, I'll be very surprised if people can figure out whose style I'm copying for this video. For uh, for this video, because I'm de I am taking inspiration from another YouTuber, and it's not Picari. I don't care what any of you say. <sighs> Shiny Angel, three is not three months is not um three months is not chocolate. It's bronze. 
Is it well known? I think they are. I don't know who Artemis is. <laughs> who is it? Well, I... You're gonna have to find out. I, w I want to see, I want to see if it's noticeable because I feel like I have copied them. I feel like I have copied them, but I want to see if it's actually noticeable. Artemis was the ace dog I was talking about. Okay, I don't know them, I'm afraid. Cause you're my number one. Right. Ugh. But yeah, I have a guest voice in my. I have a guest voice in the video as well. Who um who you all know, probably. Yeah, you should wait for the video and then guess. So I'm sad. I have to switch to German streams. That's okay, Andy. Thanks for being here. And thanks for your subscription. It means a lot to me. Auf Wiedersehen. So yeah, there, there is there. I've got the voice of someone you all know. In um, I've got the voice of someone you all know, or you all should know, in the video. TTFN. Should have said something in German. Mm. Yeah. It's the Deutsch. It's the Deutsch. Do you have any idea how hard it was not to say the word pet after a Wiedersehen? That's the only reason I remembered that. I don't actually know what, um, I don't actually know what hello in German is. Did I get another color as well with four months? Uh, I think it's, I think it's one, two, three, six, nine, twelve. Hello. Also, I had a stress dream the other night. On six, you get silver, I think, yeah. Gout Romante, hello! Make sure I've got the term right. So you had a stream. Chocolate. Hobnobs! <laughs> okay, okay, cool, cool, cool. So, all to stop for no reason. So Shiny Angel, are you ready to create a poll, please? How are you doing? I'm doing bad. <laughs> Smiling and laughing now. Excellent apricot. I hope you're I hope that helped. <laughs> oh actually, actually, apricot, because it's evil, because it because it's evil. Because it's evil. <laughs> Jaffa cakes! <laughs> yes, biscuits! Jaffa cakes! That wasn't texting, I was looking something up. So, there are a few, there are a few examples of interspecies mating between, between um, giant river otters and sea otters. 
much like much like mules, who are donkeys and horses, they are not. They're not. Um, oh, Ben Danny. Ben Danny. Fifteens followed. Ben Danny. Welcome here. Ben Danny. Thanks for following. Ben Danny. You're so cool. How's my new best friend? Oh, oh, we haven't seen Octoberus for a while. Anyway, so. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Right, so. Um, it is possible to crossbreed sea otters and river otters, but much, but much like, but much like mules, they are not fertile. But a bre a breed between a um, crossbreed between a river otter and a sea otter, well, a giant river otter, because it's it's only a special specific breed, because you know there's lots of different breeds of sea otter. Oh fuck! One sec, one sec. The um. Uh, much, much like a crossbreed, much like a crossbreeding between a sea otter, much like a crossbreed between a donkey and a mule is called a donkey, a donkey and a horse called a mule. A crossbreed between a sea otter and a river otter, a giant river otter, is called a roe otter. A roe otter, R O E T T R O R O E O T T E R, roe otter. Is that? Truth or lies? Is it truth or lies? That rhymes with the Bob Bob the Builder. It good. That that was the Bob the Builder um, uh, tune. So was that truth or lies? So here is. So today we're making paws. We're having. It's been a stressful morning. It's been a very stressful morning, so we're taking a little bit of a pause. So was that was that truth or was it lies? Was it truth or lies? It's a crossbreed between a giant river otter and a sea otter called a row otter. A row otter, or rotor. Yeah, no, row otter, that's the one. It's got an, another O in it, I keep forgetting that. Laugh about something, I don't know, just laugh evilly. <laughs> there you go. I know that was more of a cackle, but whatever. Right, uh... Oh, you got Animal Crossing! Jerry on hello, how are you doing? You mean pause. Yes, shiny angel, that was the joke. I don't even have to ask. I mean, no, I'm I'm not actually feeling great today. I, I'm feeling I'm feeling I'm feeling pretty crap this morning. Because I um because it just this morning took a lot out of me because I had a lot of failures with um I had a lot of failures um, trying to record a YouTube video that I was um, otherwise really proud of. And it took ages to get it recorded. And when it's recorded, and now that it's recorded, it's not actually recorded particularly well. Because my the camera on my phone, whilst being very good, um, my phone overheats at the drop of a hat when it's recording. So I wasn't able to record my, um, I wasn't able to record a particularly good quality recording. So I'm gonna have to do a lot of post-production on it, which is a pain, but but like in theory, I do have a YouTube video done and, and not, not done, well recorded and just ready for the editing, which is fine, which is good. So so that's there, that, that's there and, and in the can. And like as is, as is said, I, I, think. I, think that, I think that's the saying, right? My CPU should probably not be at um, should probably not be at um, 90 degrees, should it? So, a bit confused. Why you only have 20 viewers? Uh, it's a long story. Uh, ot ot ot.
Turns out, uh, turns out a lot of my viewers. Turns out a lot of my viewers came from um, the stream team I was part of, and that stream team has collapsed. But also, it seems that someone was um, someone was view botting the stream team, and so when the stream team collapsed, they left with their view bots. However, whatever way you look at it, whatever way you look at it, um, they have set. We've been set up well as. As basically most weekdays, we can be guaranteed, we can be out guaranteed 30 to 35 viewers, and then it fluctuates around that, which is a lot more than some people can can um, ask, a lot more than some people expect. So we have we have a solid group, we have a solid group of people, shall we say, which which I which I'm pretty which I'm pretty proud of. I'm proud of you all. So thank you everyone. You know what? Who was here for yesterday? Who was here for yesterday's stream, by the way? I mean, yeah, our, um, our, um, like, literally our, um, we're all new close friends. Yeah, our, literally, our, um, subscriber count hasn't gone down. Just, just our discoverability's gone down. So... The majority of chat, the majority of chat thought that a crossbreed between an, a river otter and a sea otter is called a row otter. R-O-E-O-T-T-E-R. So let me jump into chat quick. And I will tell you. I just made it up. I hadn't even planned ahead. I literally just made that up on the spot. So it is untrue. I do not know. I do not know if, even if you can breed different uh, different species of otters together, like you can with like tigers and ligers and whatnot. So yeah, there we have it. Tiffin Tiffin one, which is rare. Oh, actually. Can I, who was here? Who was here? Um, I thought they sound a bit like Roakinator. So I said four. Oh, that's fair. Who was here for yesterday's stream, by the way? Who was here for yesterday? Yesterday's stream where I was hunting villagers. Who was around for that? Comes new first owner species. I mean, I was here for. It. I was here for. It. Okay, cool. So what I'm actually going to do now is we. I, I, ju I just want to. I just want to show you guys something. Let's ju I just want to. I just want to show you guys something quick. Uh, will this work? Will this? Uh... Okay, that's. Oh, I'd have. To, I think I'd have to restart. Oh no, there we go. Right. Okay. Okay. Let me just. Too bad you didn't take stitches. You didn't. You didn't find any dreamies. Yeah. Well, I cap. Oh god, there's a delay on. There's a delay on this now. So, I I spent. So I spent a hunt. I spent sixty-seven tickets on stream. I spent 67 tickets on stream, for reference. So dreamies are your dream villagers. Are, are, are your dream villagers. The, the, the villagers you like the most. Like, we've got Whitney here, who is one of, who's my favorite. I think she's grumpy, or she might be pe petty. But so, I went on and I spent, I, 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 Increase the total amount that we um, that we spent hunting villagers. You know, Animal Crossing is overlapping. So I spent I increased the amount we spent on on um, hunting for villagers to 122. And look! We got business. 
this cat! We got business cat! So, his, um, his house is where Sherb's house is going to be in the end. Give him a maid outfit. Oh! Give me a chance. Give me a chance. I, I, I need to... Um, I haven't unlocked gifting him yet. But yeah, you can see the houses along here are all this colour. And Sherb's house is that colour as well. So I need to move his house up to the um, up to the bigger plots up 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 the um, up there. But yeah, so Sherb's house is down there. But there's a plot up here waiting for him. Yeah, this plot is for um, this plot is for Raymond. Business goose, that's cool. Am I the only one? Yeah, so th these are the nice plots for, some, for the uh, mismatched houses. But then up here, I, I showed you guys this yesterday. But w So yeah, we've got, we've got Kid Cat, who's number one and red themed. So he's got his red themed giant robot down there in the silo. With a lit, with kind of forced perspective. It, it like, you can kind of, you can kind of imagine. You can kind of imagine that, the, that it's like giant because it's got the small, it's got the like small, uh, vehicle and then you've got the blue um the blue giant robo over there which it which is agent s's and then you've got their little com I'm, I'm gonna build this up to a, be a command center whether it's where they're deployed from so you've got the blue and red superhero suits and like the the whole power ranger stuff yeah so i'm really proud of that myself but yeah so let's um Let, let's stop this because this isn't um this is just me um this is just me kind of um uh buying time i guess because like i don't know i'm tired i i'm i'm tired so i i want to um i just want this to be nice and calm i'm not doing oh that's that is a really that's a really cool idea yeah so also Roku, I'm going to um, I'm going to turn my own house into a into like a kaiju factory. I'm going to show my, I'm going to turn my own house into a kaiju factory on the other side of the island with like giant um, with like a uh, giant monster statue behind it and such. So so like like it, it's like a it's like a children's TV program where where the villains are just uh, just over the horizon. Art! This is you showing off. It is me showing off. Mm. So yeah, at, as I promised... Right, I'm out of... Scat there we go. So, I did promise that once we, ha once we had the dragon done, we were going to be moving on to our paid commission work. What's your favourite biscuit? Ah! God damn it. I'll sort that out later. My gifted sub ran out, so I bought a random emote. Oh, cool. Uh, my favorite biscuit. Um, milk chocolate digestives. Milk chocolate digestive. It's just the best overall biscuit because it's so versatile. It's really nice to... It, it's it's got three things. Back in a little bit, gotta go cut grass. So the the milk chocolate digestive has three things going for it. One, it dunks really well. It dunks in um, it dunks in tea really well. Two, unlike a lot of biscuits, unlike a lot of biscuits, it 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 gets eaten just fine without dunking. And three. There is there is a little bit of separation between the um, top layer, between the chocolate layer and the um, and the like the, the biscuit beneath it, which means you can dissect it as you go in the same way that you would eat you would eat a um, in the same way that you'd eat a um, in the same way that you'd eat like a a um, jaffa cake separately. So so you've got that little bit of tactile fun. 
Um, so it, it like works on all levels. Voidless Dragon! Voidless Dragon! Welcome to the channel, Voidless Dragon! Following on Twitch chat, maybe jumping into talk. They might just be lurking, but they're cool for following. You love Voidless Dragon. I love Voidless Dragon. Chat loves Voidless Dragon. Chicks dig Voidless Dragon. Bam, ba -dum, ba -dum. Nice. Thank you, Voidless Dragon. Thank you. Why, why is poop what why is poop called poop instead of second hand food? Oh! Roku the hyena, thank you! Thank you, that got me the final emote! I now have I now have all 25! I now have all 25 of the pride emotes. Thank you! Wow! Also, I'll talk for no reason. Congrats on receiving your gifty sub. Also, uh, void, dr voidless dragon. Do you like dragons? Do you like dragons? Do you like squishy? Do you like squishy? Should I boop them more? Should I boop them more? I like this dragon a lot. Can't wait to sell it. <laughs> ugh, ugh. I'm getting better at this. I'm getting better at this, which is nice. It's nice. Mm -hmm. So yeah, hopefully, hopefully, if I get the YouTube channel going and growing, we can start. Uh, we can start expanding. We can start expanding our Twitch audience again. You know, that's the plan. That's the plan, because like like half the reason I want to um, I want to I want to get my YouTube channel sorting out a bit sorted out a bit more. Isn't that the tune you do for like waffle song that you sung here? Uh, waffle song? I don't remember that. But yeah, so it's my um, like one of the reasons why I'm doing. I can't watch the video. Uh, what video, Apricot? So yeah, one of the reasons why I want to get the YouTube channel, the, the actual furry YouTube channel going, is just to have another way of getting people into the stream. Because, like, currently, currently, hands in the air, we are not growing like we were before. That is because our numbers were being inflated by the stream team we were in. Hopefully, if we, um, hopefully, if Wild Abandon finally gets around and, ad and adds me, we'll be get back on track. But yeah me similar I guess it's just me thinking it's a similar I mean I don't listen to too many songs I don't, I don't know what waffle so, I don't know what waffle so, song you're thinking about the nook goblins are adorable <laughs> yeah they kind of are but you know what I mean when I call them nook goblins they're definitely nook goblins I've heard people call them nooklings but that so while the band is taken up frozen twitch basically sun Sirius. Do you like waffles? Yes, I like waffles. Do you like cupcakes? Yes, I like... Oh, I see. No, no, it's not that track. It's not that one. I don't even know where that's from. Do you like French toast? Yes, I like French toast. I, I have proven I don't know what French toast actually is, haven't I? It's a fennec. Yes, yes, that's right. French toast is a fennec fox. That is true. It's toast made in a French toaster. Ha ha ha! I can't. I can't. Oh, I can't. I can't. Oh, I can't wait to watch the video. Okay, I see. I see. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I haven't edited it yet, so it ju it's just all recording so far. I, I didn't, I did enough, I did the editing, because it, it's weird, it's like a whole, it's a whole process, you know? 
basically, I've got I've got a lot of I've got a lot of stuff edited together, but I've, I've now I've now recorded my side of it, and we've got like oh, I don't know. It's a whole thing. Excuse me, sorry. <sighs> oh, do I have a cold after all of that? No, no, I can't. It's got to just be allergies. What sort of content will you be uploading to your channel? So this channel's going to be sort of comedy, comedy and vlogging and like thought, comedy and vlogging. Wow, I've already got like 30, I've already got like 30 subscribers. That's cool. Hey, Evil Plush. I've already got like 20 subscribers. That's kind of cool. Hey, Evil Plush, how you doing? Also, don't forget to ring the bell. Because I don't know what, I don't know what. Um... So yeah, I, I've, I've got a couple of different styles of video that's going to be going up on them. There's going to be, there's going to be fairly free form vlogs there's going to be um fairly free form thoughts and like and discussion and such and then there's going to be edited comedy videos yeah well evil plus you've had a bit you and e you Isaac and poke have all had a kind of um, have all had a kind of um uh spoiler a trailer for the trailer for the channel haven't you You've seen, you've all seen the channel intro. Sounds legit. I hope so. <laughs> so yes, there will be videos like Pakari videos. Cause I know you all, I know you all think I'm just trying to be Pakari, <laughs> but I'm not, I'm trying to be a different YouTuber. I mean, I'm not, I'm not trying to be my own YouTuber. I am trying to copy a copy a YouTuber whose style I like. Fur floating around, yeah. I wonder if I'm actually allergic to this uh, to this fake fur. Could you imagine? I I think I might have taken my allergy meds a little late this morning. What with everything that happened, I got a little bit um, distracted and didn't take my meds early. Did you have a problem as well when you made Tiffin? Uh, no, I, I don't think I'm allergic. I don't think I'm actually allergic to it. I mean, maybe, who knows? Maybe you had that problem. Oh, 22 subscribers. Ooh. You guys are cool. I mean, considering I was wearing, considering I was wearing, uh, I, I've worn, I was wearing Tiffin for most of the morning. I don't think I'm, um, oh, evil plush. I've just had, I've just had an awful, awful morning. I, 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 I have, um, I've basically, I've basically had to record, I've basically had to record the same YouTube video, um, four times because of technical difficulties and I uh, and that was wearing that was wearing my full fursuit I took the head off between videos but there was like a bunch of time between it and uh, sad if I had an allergy that I want a fursuit when I'm fully grown honestly I don't think it's the I don't think I, I don't think you can be allergic to to well you probably can but I don't think I don't think I'm actually allergic to the fursuit fur because when you're allergic to an animal you're you're usually allergic to their saliva or secretions because it's a because it's a biological thing and like when you're allergic to cats 
you're allergic to their saliva. And the reason the reason it's cat fur that gets you is because cats like lick themselves all the time. And like, which actually is a bit curious because I'm allergic to horses as well. Yeah, yeah, you can technically be allergic to anything. I I think. But yeah, so evil plush. This morning was this morning was stressful. So I I'm um I'm kind of I'm kind of emotionally drained right now because of it, and it's uh, and it's really annoying. I I told this I told the whole story earlier this morning, but so I'm not going to go through it again. However, I should probably just make myself feel better by the fact that we got the shots we need. The, the video quality isn't great. But that's because I'm trying to use mobile phones instead of actual cameras, and I, I need I need a um, video camera to make this channel actually work properly. But we're gonna we're gonna work with what we have for the moment because like it, it's it's one of those things where what what's the best tool to use for this job, whatever you have access to. But it whipped cream and stuff like that without without looking at that. But made myself some sauce, yes, and actually we got lactose free cream for it. Oh, nice! I'm wondering if it would be a good idea to tell them. I mean, I don't see the problem with it myself. Maybe have them watch the fandom or something. Maybe have them drop by the stream and see how wholesome everything is. No, Raccoon, it's completely random. And Mira, Mira is a good catch there. She's one of the she's one of the best big sister. Oh, it's not completely random. But you'll always get a I think you'll always get a jock. You'll always get a jock, a big sister, which is Mira, and a normal villager. I I think that's how it works. <laughs> so yeah, no, you uh it's 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 completely different. Like I got um I got Rudy and Flo. What's your favourite drink? Uh, Blueberry Nakai uh, Rockstar. Rockstar energy drink. Or mango... Um, mango juice. Just mango juice. Mango's good. So yeah, Mira is a good catch. Mira's cool. I like Mira. She's not one of my dreamies, though. I had Ruby, Rudy and Cherry. Got rid of Rudy, luckily. Yeah, Cherry is Cherry's like Cherry's like the most popular, um, most popular big sister, um, big sister uh, villager, and even she's not particularly popular. Fear back. Got to get a drink. Okay. Right. I need to cut some lining. Where did I put the lining fabric? Oh, there it is. Cool. All right. We import fresh ones and they're amazing. Oh. Don't taunt me. Mac is kind of ugly, not going to lie. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Isn't Mac uh, otter lining? Yep. I'm gonna use I'm gonna use otter themed lining for like all of my fursuits because it's me. And I'm allowed to do that, you know. Right, switching to the fabric pen. Yeah, I've got, I've got, like, I had 
Jacques, Jacques on my island um, for a while, and he is ugly as sin. Also, started with peaches. Nice. Raccoon, once you're through the first day, I can um, I can come I can come and give you one of every um, what I can give you a couple of pieces of fruit of every type, so you can start your orchard. Also, it's taken a while, but I finally got my um, I, fi I finally got an all of all of the things on my jacket. Yeah, he's a he's a French bird, and he just looks ugly, and I ha I really hate him. I had Rudy on my island, and I actually kind of like Rudy, but but the um, the jock slot is a very contested slot, if that makes sense. So, like, th there's a lot of good jock villagers, and Rudy is just not interesting enough. Oh, tot, tot! Whereas I'm actually really glad, like uh, Agent S was my third villager, and I've kept him because I really like his. I really like her kind of whole. A um, wait, slot. Yeah. Um, all villagers fall into like one of eight different um, personality types. J is my jock. Oh. So yeah, all villagers fall into one of eight different personality types. And I, I want to make sure I've got, I have one of every personality type and two of, um, and one of it, and, and no doubles on species. So, so since I want one of every personality, one, uh, since I want one of every personality type, if I want, um, I can have one, I can have one of every personality type plus two doubles and jock there's a lot of good jocks out there so that's careful that's there's a lot of good lazy villages in fact i've got three lazy villages right now which is a pain because they're all really good i have i have um i've got pietro who is a creepy murder clown i have julian who is a literal, actual unicorn, and the inside of his house is the best thing in Animal Crossing. Whereas Pietro's is the most disturbing thing you'll ever see in Animal Crossing. And I have uh, Raymond, who is a mother effing business cat, and one of, the best one of the best design characters in the game, in my opinion. And looks just like Adam from Adam Rooms Everything. So I really like him. So I need to I need to figure out if I want to drop either Julian or um, or Pietro, Be so I can have like two doubles of something else. Because I've got Kid Cat who is a jock, and I've also got I think I've got another jock. I think I'm, or, or maybe I've got two Peppies. I can't remember. He's, yeah, yeah, um, yeah. He's got heterochromia as well, which is really cute. He's my heterochromatic kitty. But I'm just waiting for Flo to move out now. Once Flo moves out, I'm, I can replace her with... Like, I really want... Sh I, I'm, so, Sherb is amazing, but I really want Bam as well. Bam is lovely. Bam is, a, Bam is so cute with his... Um, Bam's really cute with his, like, uh, little freckles. But he's also in a very, con he's like, in a very contested slot. If that makes sense. I don't know what I'm going to do if they come out with um, more villagers. He's a lazy one. Oh, Bam's lazy. Oh, my stag. I you like Eric. I mean, lazy is a ver lazy is a hard slot to fight for because I've got three lazy villagers now, and I need to decide which one of them is getting the heave ho. I mean, thankfully I've got N. Oh, that toxic fulf! That fulf is toxic. Thanks for the mini host. That toxic fulf. Whoop whoop whoop. Wait, is that toxic false why, why I'm feeling so ill today? 
Is that why I'm feeling so ill today? I think it's just because I had a crappy morning, you know? I don't know. Ugh. Fourth goes. That talks it fourth. How are you doing today? AC villagers. <laughs> Where the love for Flick? Oh! Oh, voidless. Well, because he's not a villager, you know. But, so, I only got Animal Crossing like a month ago now. And like two weeks before that, the community was going nuts over like the, the furry community was going absolute nuts over um over um flick and i didn't really get it and then it took like two weeks or like three weeks or whatever like two and a half weeks for flick to visit my island and the moment he arrived oh my god i would do anything for flick just the fact that he's like he's like oh i love bugs i love bugs Calm it down, calm it down, calm it down. Cool, right, I'm here and I will, I will, I will, um, I'll buy bugs off you. Also, just so you know, my commissions are open. He's a commission sculptor. He's a professional artist and a commissional commission sculpt sculptor who is dating, canonically dating. He's canonically dating, um, CJ, it's so cute. Anyway, oh uh, yeah, so so he's literally a furry artist. Uh, yeah. Since when's that canon? They literally state it. They state they state that they're that they're partners. They state that they're partners and they, and they live together. And if you go looking at you looking at it, you find their roommates. So they live so they live in the same room. <laughs> They're literally dating and partners. It's so cute. I love it. So yeah, now I suddenly get why everyone loves Flick because he's amazing. And also, as someone who is an shit, as someone who is an artist, as someone who is no, they're literally roommates. Voidless. You don't share a room. You don't share a room with your. You don't share a room with your cousin. My quote unquote cousin. But yeah, so uh so yeah, evil plush monster. I'm doing the lining for um for a set of paws. Yeah, it, it is officially roomies don't have to be together. I mean I mean it's pretty canon pretty canon they are partners and they and they share a room unless they're in like an american style college situation where there's where they're sharing a room they're like canonically dating like it literally says they're roommates my earlier pfp in discord oh nice i mean voidless dragon if you enjoy my content and my um, and the peop other people in chat, you should definitely come and come and drop into our uh, Discord server. We're a, we're a lovely bunch of coconuts. We're a lovely bunch of beans. Beans. It has been confirmed, so you shouldn't be caught. It shouldn't. Re it has. Yes, it's been confirmed. It's in one of the guidebooks. To one of the guy books. They're room. They're literally roommates. Roommates. I don't know. I don't know how. I don't know how much more Sappho and her friend you can get than that. 
To be honest, I saw you in my recommended channel. Nice. Well, it's good to have you here. Bees! When I when I get some spare cash in, I'm going to um. I, I want. I still want to make my. I still want to make a a uh, a bee kimono suit, kimono style, canine style style suit. What are we doing? Well, bees, obviously. <laughs> well, we're talking about we're talking about flick, so we are. Um, we're, we're getting into the the great the the um, spirit of the great infestation. I love how I love how borderline cultish she is, and now that I see this is a fennec, it makes me remember a friend of mine uh, made a uh, made a fennec persona. Nice. You can see the um, radar dishes that are the um, fennec ears in the background. But yeah, voidless dragon. Um, we just finished this Dutch Angel Dragon. Yeah, um, Dark Cameron, that's, that's why I'm equating it to Sappho and her friend, where they can't confirm it, but it's all, but it's like basically written like that, so. But yeah, so this is, um, but yeah, so this is uh, this is our lovely, lovely um, glowing rainbow duchy called Sprinkle Donut, and as you can see, they are donut themed. And then we have so that's a Dutch angel dragon, and this is an actual more traditional dragon. Oh, sorry, um, yeah, so Sappho, so yeah, Voidless Dragon. This is a dragon that we finished last week. That I thought you might approve of if you're a dragon, but yeah, so. So Sappho and her friend is a, um, is a, is a, um, is the idea that, um, that, like, hist mostly historians, but it all, it comes up a lot in just, in just social media and such will tend to overlook um, queer relationships. So when they find two when they find two men or two women writing love letters to each other, they would use that as an example of just how how good of friends they are. They're such good friends. Look, they keep writing each other. Ah, oh, such good friends. They keep writing it writing to each other so much, spending all this time sharing a bed together. Ah oh, and like, the, like, but then it, it's like the subreddit's all about, all about sort of. Um, th there's, there's, there's a post. One of, one of my favourite posts, and it gets reposted quite often, is um, are two brides in their dress, in their dresses, like hugging each other, with hugging each other, showing their rings, and the comment is, "Oh, these brides are adorable. Their husbands must look amazing as well." When it's obvious that they're marrying each other. <laughs> That they are, they are each other. They are each other's brides. It is. It's a lot of fun. But it's the whole like, oh, oh, our, oh, your aunt, ne oh, your aunt never married, but she did live with. She did live with. Um, she did live with that woman Jamie for all that time. Yeah, Jamie never married as well either. And they shared one bed. I, I think it's because they couldn't afford the heating, you know? But oh, they've been sharing they've been house sharing for 40 years now. <laughs> Hope Donut didn't get a head injury. Voidless, no. It, 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 the, the head's all foam, so. One to, oh, he goes through those subreddits. It's amazing. Yeah. I used to I used to watch a, a few like content creators like that, but it kind of got very samey. No, um, Voidless Dragon. I think they're just a bit dizzy now. 
Don't worry. Um, the only the the only way the only way we'd be able to confirm if there are, if I've actually received an injury is is if um is if their other eye is a different colour. That means that we've kind of perforated their iris. Oh no! Look, they've got a bruised eye now. Oh no! Don't call the po the pooly the police a police on me for domestic abuse. Oh, whoa, oh, whoa, oh, whoa. So, what's him get my hands in the post and don't even think about, yeah. <laughs> I'm calling the popo, no! <laughs> Blessed images. Oh, I've not been to that one. I like r slash ornaverts. Ornaverts. It's um, r slash or, but for um, uh, invertebrates. So you get lots of cute bugs. I'm not going back to jail. Tra? I don't know that one. I know suddenly gay, and uh, there's. There's, oh, r slash are the straights okay is amazing. <sighs> oh, whoa, jail. No. Although, I do in the, um, oh, dot, dot! For what? Not sure. Not sure, but I ended up, I ended up a, I end. Not sure why, but I ended up a vid on asexual memes. My friend, my favourite one was a comic where someone was sitting in a bed at night and their brain telling them, it's time to question their sexuality again. Do you mind if I ask you if you ever have moments where you're confused whether or not you're asexual? Um, no, Sun Sirius. Because I don't have the drive, if that makes sense. Um, I, I, like, like, it doesn't... It's not a thing that it occurs to me to question. Because it, it doesn't come up. It's like asking, do you, ever, do you ever wake up at night and think, why aren't I stamp collecting right now? Because you don't have that urge to stamp collect. I don't have the urge to go out and get laid or anything. So, um, so, so, so it's not something that I, that I lay around thinking like, oh, Oh, should I do this? No, it's, it's just not, it's just not like in my remit. Yeah, Dark Cameron, I had, a, I had a similar thing when I was younger. Just, uh, just my brain overthinks things. I'm just thinking, uh, yeah. I mean, Honestly, I, I, I expect at some point in the future of humanity, the concept of sexual orientation will just melt away and you will just, you will just end up with who you end up with sort of thing. You'll just go through life and if you end up, if you end up feeling attracted to this person or that person, you'll ask this person or that person out. And the whole idea that, the whole idea that, that, that you might have, um, you might have a preference one way or the other is is would kind of be irrelevant because you you'll just fall for the people you fall for if that makes sense Ugh. where is the rest of this fabric what have I done? I'm mean, honestly out. I can't be out of this fabric already. I've only done like two or three things with it. Where is the rest of this fabric? Am I really this dumb? Probably. Have I actually lost it? Oh my god, it's so warm in here. As long as the person, as long as the person that you are in love with is a, is 
consenting. Because, because there's a big difference. There's like a big difference. Uh, I wish my brain would shut up sometimes, but I now, now, no, figure out I'm romantic. I, I am, I am on the romantic spectrum. Okay. Because like, there's a big difference between um, telling someone you love them and telling someone you love them a hundred times a day. They never reply to you, but you keep, te you keep telling them. You text them. You change your number. They block you. You change your number. My ma was together with my with with, with a man, but was eleven years old. Ah, oh. tables are handy. Sorry. Oh. Oh, I haven't got this fan on. Oh. Apparently, I don't have any more of this. I can't find any more of this fabric. I ordered meters of it. I, I, I haven't used that much of it, have I? I swear. This is really weird. I don't know where it's gone. I've only lined like two pairs of hands with it. Oh. Lots of pizza, hello! I hope that question did. No, no! Uh, Sonsiris. We stream under the LGBTQIA tag, so. So, I, and like, I am. I'm pretty open about it because I want more people to be aware of it as a thing. Like Ubudayo uh, said earlier, they felt the same. So that, that makes me, that hopefully makes us both feel more valid. Who wants me to visit their Animal Crossing island? I need to order some more of this uh, fabric now, don't I? God damn it. I can't, but I, I, I don't believe I've used it all, but I can't find it. So I'm just gonna reorder it and order a lot more. Because I think, I think, I think, I think the USB, uh, the USB stick I've got now, sh the USB LAN thing I've got now should actually work. It should actually work, so this will be a good test for it, I suppose. Uh, purchase history. Ah, oh, with a loaf. Oh, thank you. For oh no, you're welcome. Purchase. No. Purchases. Okay. Anytime. People are. It would kind of be disingenuous for me to stream under that tab tag if I didn't answer questions about it, if that makes sense. Uh, yeah, I ordered four meters of it. There should definitely be more. I should definitely still have more of it, but... Um, That Fennec is, is that a Fennec in the background? Sully! <coughs> yes, it is. Mother of Platypie. Welcome, Sully. Don't do things by halves here. This is a friend I was talking about. Oh, sweet. Yeah, sorry. I, I'm really cute. Thank you. I, I'm really, I, I'm, 
Oh, by the way, so if any of you want to see my personal fursuit... So this is my personal fursuit that, that we finished on stream um, a couple of... Um, we finished this on stream a couple of... Um, like, a couple of weeks ago now. But we, we made it from start to finish, every part of it, on stream. So, um, so hopefully, if you're interested in seeing how, like, I go about making stuff like that, you'll, you'll um, hang around and come and join us in the future. It'd be really cool to have you here. But in the meantime, I've, I've, ha I've had a bad morning trying to get my, um, trying to get a YouTube video um, recorded because of a lot of technical issues. So we're kind of doing something, um, I'm your friend, I'm teased. Of course you're my, f well, you're my friend, Sully. Welcome. And Sully, if you want to make a fursuit, I'm definitely, um, I'm definitely here to, um, I'm definitely here to help you out if you need it. Oh yeah, that, that fennec head belongs to Shiny Angel. This belongs to Bloody, and everything else in everything else in here is um, is my is up for sale. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I've I've got four meters of that fabric, so that it should definitely still be around. But I do not have the. Oh yeah, well, Sully, if you want to join us as a friend, you should come join our Discord server. It's lovely. Also, ugh, YouTube, I know, but I'm launching a new YouTube channel. It's going to be launching next week, so. Definitely subscribe and ring the bell. Um, you know what? Roku? Not Roku, sorry. Uh, was it Roku? It's not Roku. It's uh, Rickon. Is it Rickon? Am I, am I visiting Rickon's island? Sh should we do that? Should we just visit someone's Animal Crossing island, you know? I'm... I'm so so this morning I spent I spent like um, I spent a bunch of time this morning trying to get um, trying to get um, a YouTube video recorded and it was awful because my, my hardware kept screwing up every single time. So I went through a 16 page script. Are Jaffa cakes biscuits or cakes? They're definitely cakes, Apricot. Which is why I, which is why when you ask me to be to be evil, don't think you can. I just started day one. Oh no! Oh no! Is there anyone else? Anyone else I can visit? I mean, they are cakes. They're, they're, they've literally, it's literally been proven they're cakes, you know? I don't even own a Switch, that's fair. I've, I'm sorry to the new people. You got fluff up, you know, Stiff, and I think I might. Oh, God damn. I'm, I'm really sorry to the new people, new people in the, um, in the stream. Because... Usually I do a lot more interesting things, especially on Sunday. I try to make Sunday a bit of a gala day, you know? But, oh, I've just, I just wrecked myself this morning. I absolutely shrecked myself this morning. I'm exhausted. Mm. But you know what? How about I give a proper tour of my island then? Actually, before we go any further, let's just double check. I mean, this switch. So, hands in the air. This switch was bought for me by by you lot, by by the viewers. Hey, you will bounce back, but oh yeah, yeah, that's fine. Um, I'd say my island, but mine doesn't exist. Ah, yeah. I just want to double check. Let's just double check. Yeah, let's do a let's do a proper tour, shall we? Th this is just easier than making right now. I don't know. There we go. Join Discord. Yay! I just want to double check. Actually, let's. Uh, there we go. 
Because my island is a state right now. Oh! This is from an infested plot. This earth, this terrarium, this Otis land. That's from Flick! See, I, I just wanted to show off. You know, even though my you may be having a rough time you still make a great stream thanks for being devoted thank you poke that that means a lot to me so i also want to show like i also want to show i've played the stalk market a bit so that's two and a half mil so that's two and a half mil um in the bank from playing the stalk market with no loan um and then, I, I haven't done anything on the inside of the house yet. I haven't, um, I'm, I'm concentrating on the island before I work on the actual house itself. And then if we go down here. This is 40,000, or is it 4,000 turnips. This is one inventory full of turnips. So what I do is every week, I buy a full inventory of turnips, no matter how much they cost. These cost like four and a half thousand because it was like hundred. It was like hundred and nine per. And then I go and find people. Um, and then I then I go find people online who who are whose nooklings are um, buying turnips for six hundred or more. And then you sell them, you get like three grand, three mil. And I've needed that because I've been moving about all of my houses a hell of a lot. They were zooming about at the speed of a snail in Batmobile. Oh, that's cute. So let's um, let's go let's go and start at the beginning. Yeah, KK, okay, okay, don't care. Start at the beginning. So you come in and there's the museum kind of ahead. I don't like the museum placement now, so I'm gonna I'm gonna be I'm changing it up. But yeah, this is my this is my overall island. Here, here's who we have. We have me. We've got Mari uh, Marina, who I love. We've got Flo, who you'll see how I feel about her in a bit. <laughs> Julian, who's lovely. Uh, we've got Morang, who is the first, first like non, non like essential. I usually get three inventories, and I use the term calculator online to figure where my spike. And if no spikes, then I use online. Oh, Sally, that's cool. I I ju I, I kind of just just go for the um. I kind of Tiff, and it's weird because. My IRL nickname is KK, no joke. Wow. So yeah, Morang was the first uh, was the first villager I found ever on any of the islands, and I invited her, and now I love her forever. Sherb has made my life 100% better. We have Kid Cat and Agent S up here with their giant robots. Whitney, who is lovely. Um, Raymond, who is literally unpacking right now. I got him yesterday, and oh. And then Pietro, who is disturbing. And I don't know if I want to keep him on my island. But yeah, uh, Ma M Marina is adorable. Absolutely adorable. Look at her. So yeah, this is the entry. You see, all of this is themed for like, Raymond is a good boy. Yeah, you can see all of this is kind of themed for this black uh, wrought iron look all around here. I'm this much of a nerd. Look how much of a nerd I am. <laughs> I got Raymond, nice Sully. So this this is kind of an I'm trying to figure out what um what of these fossils I actually want to have outside the museum because I'm because this was supposed to be like like my boardwalk. But what I'm actually going to do, I'm gonna lower the um, museum I'm gonna take the museum out, put that somewhere else. I'm gonna put a second um, resident here with a house and then turn it into a gift shop and then take all of these out and put them inside the house. And then this is my house. I'm gonna put that somewhere else. You're all subbed to an absolute dork. I know, right? 
Oh, look how nice this is, by the way. This like little step down pattern that goes down into this area. How nice is that? What happens to Pete? No matter how many people, he will always be a good boy. I know, right? He's one of the best, just, he's one of the best designs in the game. I really like good designs. So yeah, this is Flo's house. That is barbed wire. The zebra turkey fish is also known as a lionfish, Riku. So if you've heard of lionfishes, which are a really nasty invasive species. So yeah, this is um, Flo because I hate her and want her off my island. So yeah, suck it Flo. Oh, so I wanted to do something really different that I've not seen anyone else do for their campsite. So this is my campsite. And the idea is this part of the um, this part of the beach is um, is roped off, and it's like a private beach area for the campsite. And we've got a little portaloo over here for them, and we've got all of the um, all of the stuff. So when the campsite's here, when the, when the tent is here, it kind of implies that this is like a private area for the um, for the pe for the um, campsite people. I, I I've not seen any, any anyone else do that before, so I kind of like it. Uh, here are my, these are still my parks, my parks. Children's playground. Arranged perfectly just so I can like fit through it. <laughs> um, I don't know how anybody's going to have a game of football there, but you know, it's there. Uh, we've got, oh, here we go. Here's my gardening area. Got a little radio, got a little place to lay down and read a book. Got a picnic, watering can next to um, watering can next to the faucet, but I don't need that anymore because I've got a golden water can. So, oh, me, me, Mel, hello. So yeah, this is a this whole area is about getting um, getting hybrids like pink roses and and yeah, so. I haven't filled it out properly yet. I need to come back and redo it a bit. And then over here, we've got something that I'm very proud of. Oh, I hear a... Um... Where are you? Oh, this is going to be a fishing shack, eventually. So, this is something I'm really proud of. Art, art, art! Me, Melissa Porch! Hello! Where is it? Where is it? Huh, okay, whatever. I, I can I can hear it, but I can't see it. Anyway, this is what I'm really proud of. This is my this is my rock quarry. So all of my island rocks are here. Call me Poo. Well welcome Poo. Me Me meals a poo. Me meals a poo. Welcome to the channel, Meal Meals a Poo. Thanks for following, and you're now here. It's Mean Meals, it's Mean Meals a Poo, 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 Poo. So yeah, it took me ages to move these rocks over here. I'm really proud of that. And then yeah, back over here. I don't know what I'm doing with this little area here. I need to, this is kind of just storage for bushes right now. Call you poo, I will. So this is kind of just storage for bushes, because you can't like keep them in your inventory or whatnot. Um, then we've got, oh damn it, I kind of wanted that bug. Um, then we've got a little bamboo garden, which leads into, oh god. I, I really like this bamboo meme also. I really like this, like, because there's, you can't see through it, because I've blocked the path, so you have to go around and then you go through, but yeah, so. We've got my orchard with um, fruit of every type. I haven't got the fruit boxes yet. I haven't got any of the fruit boxes yet, so I'm gonna have to trade for those. And then, uh, then over here is my kind of rugged outdoorsy area. So there's a purpose for this that I'm going to um, get around once I've finished moving houses. 
Up here is where I want my home to eventually be, and I'll have a um, I'll have a giant monster behind it. So the idea is I'm gonna have a giant monster behind it, and it's all gonna look like an evil scientist layer to go against the. Um... I got stung. Ah. So yeah, the, the whole the idea of this uh, the idea of this like area here is you're supposed to travel through these dangerous passes. Travel through all of these dangerous passes to get here. Like, oh, do not enter sign. Oh, what's this? Keep out. Oh, warning sign. Oh no, what's down here? It's a pirate cove. Look at this pirate cove. Mm. So it's like, so it's a nice like decorated area for um, for uh, when red when red ship shows up. Hey, Soggy, how you doing? So it's a nice um, decorated area for when uh, Riku, when um, he ships it, he ships it in town. So then we can go around here. So this area, I'm going to extend this, um, we we'll extend this like dangerous looking um, area all around here once I've got the houses set up. So, so this isn't as obvious, you just walk up there and go in. And then we have my little teal row. Because we have Whitney's house. We have R Whitney's house. We've got, uh, I meant red, uh, raccoon. I have Pietro's house. And then, uh, so Raymond's house is there. I've got a different place that wants to go, but Sherb's house is going there. Sherb's house is going there. So you can see they're all the same color. Oh, Sherb, you're so nice. Look how cute Sherb is. Dead night, hello! Look, yeah, so so at some point, um, Sherb's house will go here. And I'm going to redevelop this little area to be an extension of the coffee shop. And this is where the museum is going to go eventually. And I'm trying to pick out what, um, what uh, fossils I want. Also, I might want, I might be trying to make a dragon. I, I saw a video where somebody made a dragon, a skeleton out of parts. Yeah, if anyone's, if anyone ever hurts, if anybody, oh, hello. If anybody ever hurts, um, Sherb. So what's in our digital gachapon? Our literal blind box. It's a go. What's a go board? Oh, actual go. Oh, that's really cute. I might put that in the um, bamboo forest. But yeah, Sagi, I'm the one that deleted your message because it took up my entire chat window. So no, very much no. So yeah. The museum's going to go here eventually, and we're going to have some fossils and exhibits out in front of it that you get to across these and bridges. And I don't know where I'm going to put whoever replaces Flo. Whoever replaces Flo. Oh yeah, they're also uh, they're also barbed wired in because I hate them. And then you've got like the more upper class resident. So yeah, this is the little coffee shop. They got the more upper class residential district up district up here that I have. So this is where this is where um, Raymond's going to go, and then we've got Mar no. This is I don't. This isn't Marina. I don't think. Uh, whose house is this? This is Meringue. Okay. I, I haven't decorated. I'm going to decorate all of their gardens and such. Oh, this is Marina. Hence the pink flamingo. And then this is uh, Julian. Oh, is Julian in? Is Julian in? Yes. Oh, you can see Julian's house. His house is amazing. I love him so much. Look how wonderful this house is. It's got like the floaty float. I, I'm playing Red Dead Online. I almost got my horse killed. Oh no. Oh, I gave him that flower. So what are you crafting? Wooden double bed. Yeah, I'll have that. Yay! 
Oh, actually, I should, I should, I should let you guys see. I'll, I'll, I'll go see if Pietro is in because I can let you see the inside of Pietro's house. You can see why it is the most terrifying thing in all of Animal Crossing. But yeah, so I don't know where the, I don't know where Flo's house is going to go eventually, or the, whoever replaces Flo, because because these areas are kind of like full. I think that's Pietro's house, right? Oh, he's not in. Damn it! Died from train tracks. Sounds like you're playing Factorio. Oh, do you like these little fences used as like open gates? Had that idea myself. Oh yeah, I'm gonna do something along here as well. I don't know what I'm doing along here. Some sort of community thing. And then up here is where it starts to get all sci-fi. So we've got Agent S with his blue house and Agent S has the number two on him. So we've got his blue robo here. You can see how big that robot actually is. First thing it looks ace. Thanks, Alex, Alex Fly UK. So yeah, you can see how big the robot actually is by how small the um, car is next to it. And then you've got their like red and blue superhero outfits. And here, here's the red house for Kid Cat. And look, 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 look. The giant robot's like the same size as the, um, as the lighthouse. It's huge. And so yeah, they've got their satellite dishes so they can fight crime. And I'm, go I'm going to I'm going to deck this place out as like a um, sci-fi headquarters, which will go wonderfully with my um, with my uh, kaiju factory the other side. Anyway, Alex Fly UK, hello. And yeah, that brings us back around here. go down here. So we go up and around here. So yeah, so we've got like this area with the sneaky, sneaky bandit, uh, bandit red comes. And then if you go around here, this is where I'm going to put the kaiju factory over here. So it's, it's, it's like a Saturday morning cartoon where the villain is always just, a, just out of reach of the um, good guys, but they're all technically all like in the same goddamn postcode. But yeah. Oh, 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 big stag beetle, big stag beetle. Shh. Yee. I don't know what I'm putting here yet. I need more ideas. I need more ideas, you know, but so yeah, that's my, that's my island. Okay, how are you doing? Uh, greetings and delight. Went out for a dog today. Oh, that's cute. Where's one of the new ones? Because I got that one recently. That's cool. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Uh... Well, okay. I've got to wash the today. Oh, cute. Which one? Oh, this one. I love this one. Ah, how cute is that? Right, so that's my island. If you've got any suggestions of what I should put into my um, into some of the other spots, please, please let me know. King Charles Cavalier Spaniel. Nice. already bought everything here. Hmm. 
Kevin, you should put an electric car manufacturing plant in the spot. How would I do that? Hidden fluff. For blathers. Yes, yes, you do. It's either 5 or 15, I don't remember. I mean, at some point, at some point I'm going to put like a down on this beach. Over here, I've got the helmets ready. I'm going to put a like bike rental place here. So I'm going to put a row of bicycles and then these two and like a bin and such. So there's like uh, free bike rentals. Oh, actually, and yeah, this is going to be a fishing shack here. You need to look at all this seaweed that's collected on the beach. Oh, oh it's so messy. Oh, yeah, do I still have that um, go set? Yes, I'm going to put the go set in here. Apparently not. There we go, right. Let's put, find a good spot in here to put the go set. Uh, we've already got a bird in here. Put it in front of. Uh, this is supposed to be like the calming, tranquil place. So yeah, let's put it next to. Um, actually, let's dig that up. No, let's not. Because I, I like having ungrown shoots around. Because it makes the makes the place look a bit more um, organic. There we go. We put the go set in front of the um, stools, so in front of the stool, so it looks like it's it looks like it's there for people to play and be around. So look how messy this area has gotten. Oh, there's so many weeds. Go and plant another weed here. Oh, I should probably learn this, shouldn't I? Yeah, that's my Animal Crossing, Animal Crossing. Oh, the weeds are escaping the, um, escaping this little colloquial area a bit. So let's, um, let's come and take them and replant them in here. Because I, I want, I want this, um, I want this place to be full of weeds and look nice and overgrown. Because it's supposed to be a really colloquial looking, not colloquial, but you know, like cottage core looking orchard. Hence the really simple looking, um, the really simple looking fencing. So yeah, what do people do? People like my island. People like my villager choice. Oh, that's lovely. <gasps> you know what we should try and do, actually. You know what we should try and do. Let's try and summon the. Um, let, let's try and summon the otter. Let's try and summon the otter, shall we? We're going to try and summon Pascal of the otter. Oh, I didn't get to flip. Oh, who don't you like, Dark Cameron? So we're looking for scallops. Ah! Yeah. The fact that she's just holding a sea urchin like that really irks me. There's now now an Animal Crossing stream. Maybe check. Uh, Raccoon, I'm probably going to head off in a bit because, uh, like, it's it's fairly obvious. Like, like I, I don't know where my materials have gone, and I'm um, and I'm not particularly well. It seems. Scallop! Oh, there he is! There he is! There he is! Otter! 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 otter, otter, otter. Come 
<laughs> Breaststroke, cool stroke, easy. Luck stroke, genius stroke, and golf stroke, not so much. <laughs> So now, there we go. So we're going to follow him because I've not seen, I've not actually seen this happen yet. I've seen video of it happening, but I've not seen it in my game. Look how chill he is. Carry on, hello. And then he breaks it open. And yeah, look at him breaking it open. And then he, he breaks it open on his belly, eats it, and then goes away. How cute is that? No, yeah, he's an otter. Oh, that's a mantis shrimp. Wow. So yeah, I think I should probably drop the stream around now because we're not making anything. And I, I kind of just like after all the after all the problems I had with my with getting my YouTube video recorded this morning, I should probably you know actually get that sorted, actually get the YouTube video sorted just so today doesn't feel like a massive waste. I don't know, it's odd, it's odd. Mr. Sindope, how are you doing? Although it is really nice now. I've got my um, I've got my studio set up so we can just drop in and drop out of um, of uh, no! got a garden, uh, garden here. Nice. So yeah, I, I've got my um, I've got my switch set up in such a way that we can just drop in and out of um, street of twi of uh, switch streaming if we want to. And also, it should now be able to hook up to the internet, which is cool. I still haven't found a pearl, actually. I'm still yet to find a pearl at all. What? I'm good, but late to the stream. Oh, that's fine, Mr. Sindo. Today hasn't been a good stream anyway. I've been, um... I kind of wrecked myself emotionally and physically this morning, and I just feel tired from it, so, um... So I, w I wouldn't feel too bad for having missed stuff. Um, we haven't had much. We haven't had, you haven't missed much, don't worry. Ugh. So yeah, this is our, so this is the um, Dutch, the Dutch Angie dragon that we did. Does everyone like them? I hope so. A chew. A chew? <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, God. <laughs> Excuse me. Sorry. Ugh. <laughs> uh. Okay, yeah. I don't know if I'm actually ill or just not, or just it's all allergies or, or it's just allergies all the way down. Ugh. I think you can learn things by watching animals. I hope so. I've been watching the fox in our garden a lot recently. He, she's very cute. I'm pretty sure it's a she at this point. I'm pretty sure it's a she. So we need we need a um, uh, we need a um, we need a good name for our for our local our resident uh, fox. I think we need a good name for our resident fox because they keep coming back. You know. Um, oh God. Uh, right. You know what? Since we've just done something otter related and that's seen, seen Pascal the otter, let's go throw some, throw some viewers at otter sparks on our way out. I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry to drop the stream like this, but I promise it'll be worth it because now, now I'm going to go and edit a YouTube video and you're all going to be impressed with it because I'm super proud of it. And you're all going to share it around everywhere. And it's going to come out in a couple of days. Maybe Wednesday, Thursday. I don't know when the best day to upload YouTube videos is. Ah! Anyway, thanks everyone for being here. Sorry for sorry for it being a bit of a crap stream. Hopefully, the new people to the stream, anyone who is new here, will come and join us tomorrow where we actually do useful things. 